Congratulations, class of 2020. It's with a lot of pride and a little bit of sadness that we say congratulations and goodbye. I'd like to give a special shout out to our graduate students earning their master's degree. I'm incredibly proud of you. I've missed you this last semester and I'm incredibly excited to see where you go from here. Once a Bobcat, always a Bobcat. Come back anytime and see us. Best of luck. Seniors, I'm so proud of your hard work and your bravery and your commitment and your perseverance. I know you all are gonna go on to do amazing things. Congratulations on your graduation. The thing I love most about being a Quinnipiac is getting the opportunity to work with such engaged and enthusiastic students. It's a privilege not only to be their professor, but to learn from them in the classroom. I wish our graduating seniors success, happiness, and health. Class of 2020. To paraphrase my favorite sports movie quote, I wish I could say something classy and inspirational, but that just wouldn't be our style. Pandemics suck, the semester was rough, but your Quinnipiac memories will last forever. Congratulations. Hey seniors, it's been great working with a lot of you in our visual design class. I wish you all the best in the future. Hey, class of 2020, uh, just wanted to give you guys a shout out for all of your amazing accomplishments and the adversity that you've overcome. Um, especially those of you who had to learn reliability testing from me in MSS 32. My favorite experience from teaching at Quinnipiac this past year was witnessing the collaborative spirit from the single camera and lighting students. They created these really amazing studio projects uh, and they were just super professional and creative. Congratulations to all you seniors. It was really great to meet you all this year. Hey there, Bobcats. Just want to congratulate you on everything that you've done so far and wish you all the success in the future. Graduates, congratulations. So incredibly proud of y'all. Cannot wait to celebrate when we are all back together, safe and sound. Congratulations. Congratulations to the School of Communications class of 2020. Hello, graduating seniors and welcome to the ever-growing School of Communication alumni family. I know you're going to continue to be fabulous, so go out in the world and show everyone what you learned. Congratulations to everyone graduating this semester. Students like you are what make Quinnipiac so special. You did it. Virtual high five. Hi, seniors. Remember way back in orientation, maybe during COM 101, when I told you how quickly these years would pass by, they passed by quickly for me too, because it has been such a pleasure and delight to get to know you and get to work with you every day. I wish you all the best. I wish you congratulations on your achievements. I'm so proud of you, and I can't wait to see what you do next. Congratulations, class of 2020. I just wanted to say how proud I am of the way you tackle the challenges of this semester. I believe that in part because of that, you are uniquely prepared to face whatever the world throws your way. I will miss you, and I look forward to seeing everything that you will do. Congratulations. Congratulations to the class of 2020. My best memories of you were working in the field together to produce awesome multimedia work for your capstone projects. I hope that you continue to do that, and remember that we're always here as a resource for you. Hey, class of 2020, congratulations, you guys made it. I know this is not even remotely close to what you had hoped or dreamed that your final few weeks at Quinnipiac would look like, but I have no doubt whatsoever that what you have learned about yourselves these past few weeks is going to serve you well when you go out into the world and do the great things that I know you are destined for. I also want to give a big special shout out to our three plus one students who are graduating this year. We've got our first crop leaving with their master's degrees. I know you guys have often heard me refer to you as our guinea pigs as we have, you've made your way through the program. Now you have officially left guinea pig status. I can, I'm very proud to call you proof of concept. Gus and I want to say congratulations to our graduating seniors and our graduating master's students. You've made my first year at Quinnipiac amazing. You're incredible students. You have so much to look forward to in your future careers. And I can't thank you enough for making my first year at Quinnipiac such a great experience. Thank you all. My first commencement at Quinnipiac was in May of 1983. And I don't think I've missed more than two or three ever since. I wish congratulations to all of you, especially to my budding film lovers and filmmakers. Have a great career, each of you. Monday mornings are my favorite. I sit down for a cup of coffee and uh, 
open Blackboard and the folder with all the new assignments which came night before and um, I can admire students' creativity and growth and innovative solutions to various problems and it's a little bit like opening Christmas presents and I get excited with uh, each one of them. Um, you guys rock! I would like to congratulate all of our seniors on the great accomplishment of graduating college. Today is truly a happy day, a day for celebration, and we faculty are proud to have you as Quinnipiac alumni. To my film and television students, stay creative and stay creating, because you are now officially the next generation of storytellers. Professor Hanley here. Soon, you'll be walking under the tall trees of your career. Don't forget the world needs its butt kicked. You're the one who can do it. Fare thee well. Hey everyone, I have so many great memories from my time here at Quinnipiac, like WQAQ, getting to produce a film senior capstone, the LA program, and honestly, I wouldn't change any of it. It all helped make these last four years the best time of my life, and I cannot thank the school enough for that. My favorite moments throughout my time at Quinnipiac were all the days spent in the media suite with my best friends or shooting photography at countless athletic events. I will never forget the opportunities Quinnipiac gave me and I will carry those memories with me forever. It's always a great day to be a Bobcat. My favorite part about Quinnipiac is all the relationships I've built over the four years here and the relationships I will keep with me for the rest of my career and the rest of my life. Quinnipiac's meant so much to me and it's just opened a world of possibility for me and I can't wait to see where it takes me after graduation. These last four years have been the absolute best of my life. I would just like to say thank you to the School of Communication, specifically the Public Relations Program, all of my professors, my advisor, everybody that I've met along the way. Thank you for making these four years full of memories, lasting friendships, and ultimately the best time I've ever experienced. Thank you, Quinnipiac. My favorite thing about Quinnipiac is how you're not just a number, and everyone approaches you with love and respect. My favorite thing about Quinnipiac is how the faculty and staff believed in me and developed me to be the true professional that I am today. Hi fellow Bobcats. I just wanted to say congratulations to all the seniors and grad students who had no idea that they would be sitting on their couches on the day of their graduation. The thing that I'm gonna miss the most about Quinnipiac is definitely the amazing faculty and staff in the School of Communications. I'm also really going to miss the simple pleasures of walking into the piazza, grabbing a cup of coffee, and sitting in front of the fireplace. I wish everyone so much success in all that they do in the future, and although it feels really cruddy right now, just remember it's not the end, it's only the beginning. Bye Bobcats! Class of 2020, it's been a doozy. I'm going to miss the relationships I've formed, the opportunities I've had, and the equipment I've used for sure. But more importantly, I'm going to miss the green pastures that is Quinnipiac Squad. Quinnipiac has given me everything I could have asked for and more. In just four years, I was able to make lifelong friendships and everlasting memories, give back to the community, excel academically, while also getting the tools to be successful in the professional world. I am so unbelievably lucky to have gone to such an amazing university and am forever grateful to always be a Bobcat. Thank you Quinnipiac School of Com for giving me the QUNLA program and Professor Hanley especially who inspired me to become the best storyteller I can be and work to make a positive impact in this world. My time here at Quinnipiac has led me to new opportunities. Um, the thing I'm going to miss most about being a QU student is definitely attending the D1 games. Um, they have been my favorite thing um, since being a student here. Hi everyone, congratulations. I'd just like to take a few seconds to thank some of the amazing professors we have here in the School of Communications. So thank you Margarita Diaz, and Amy Walker, and Rich Hanley, and Molly Yannity. Thanks you guys. The extracurricular activities at Quinnipiac are just unmatchable, and I am so happy to be part of this community. Go Bobcats! Quinnipiac was my number one school, and I'm so glad I got to attend it. I love the small community and seeing a lot of familiar faces along the campus. My favorite experience was our senior project. I took on being a production designer and I learned so much along the way. Thank you so much, Quinnipiac. My favorite part about Quinnipiac and the School of Communications was having the opportunity to be a part of so many extracurriculars. Q30 Television, QBSN, and the Association for Women in Sports Media has taught me so much for my future. Go Bobcats! It's pretty basic, but my 
favorite aspect of Quinnipiac has definitely been the people I've met along the way. My favorite memory though was my freshman year. I really wasn't sure how to edit a package so it took me until about 5 o'clock in the morning in CC when I got there in the afternoon to finish my first assignment. I'm super grateful for all that Quinnipiac and my professors have given me, but some of my favorite memories come from those sunny days hanging out on the quad with all of my friends and enjoying the sense of community that Quinnipiac has to offer. Quinnipiac's provided me with some really incredible opportunities and experiences over these last four years. I know that I'll forever hold on to the memories that I've made here. Thank you to my professors, the staff, and my peers for everything. Some of my favorite memories from Quinnipiac definitely come from traveling. Whether it was with the pep band, student media, or spending an entire semester in LA, I never would have thought coming into college I would have gone to as many places as I have. Hey everyone! I can honestly say that Quinnipiac has left such a lasting impression on my life thanks to organizations like the Student Programming Board, being able to go out and intern in Los Angeles during the spring semester last year, and also just creating campaigns for real clients in my PR classes. Everything has meant so much and I cannot thank the university enough for it. My favorite Quinnipiac memory was traveling to cover KU basketball. I learned so much and made so many great relationships. I'm so thankful for Quinnipiac for giving me these opportunities. I think my favorite day at Quinnipiac University was any day that I was able to complete a project, see thoughts on campus, go out get some food, and listen to music. One thing I love about Quinnipiac is the sense of family and closeness and community that you feel just when you step on campus, whether you're on the quad and you see someone you know and you say hi, or you're in a classroom, it just feels like home. And my favorite Quinnipiac memory is dancing alongside a fraternity in lip sync last year. It was so much fun. My favorite thing about Quinnipiac is the friends I've made everywhere I've gone. From my classes, to clubs, abroad, and even in my dorm rooms. Although these past four years went by way too fast, thank you Quinnipiac for giving me my forever friends. My favorite memory of Quinnipiac was moving into the Global International Building when I was a freshman. I got to make such lifelong friends um, across the globe um, that I've still been in contact with and haven't left their side since freshman year. Uh, and I'm so glad I got to experience that and, and, and everybody else at Quinnipiac that I can consider a lifelong friend. My favorite thing about Quinnipiac is definitely the people and the professors. It's where I've made my best friends and some of my most valuable connections. What I love most about Quinnipiac University is being able to find that group of friends that I can connect with at all times, whether we're near or far apart. My favorite memory from Quinnipiac by far has to be when I was on set, on location, filming for our senior capstone film project. I didn't even feel like I was working. I was with a great group of people and man, it's an experience I will never forget. I know the way this is ending is really tough and it sucks but I'm so proud of all of you. I'm so happy to know all of you and I'm so grateful for the experiences we've had together. And listen, this pandemic doesn't change the experiences we've shared together over the last four years and I'm always gonna be grateful for that. And I can't wait to see you all soon. So until next time, go Bobcats.